Stoicism. Not just the practice of great philosophers and famous leaders of ancient civilizations, but a discipline still practiced by many in our modern world. Welcome back to Critical Thinking Secrets, the channel that helps you improve your critical thinking skills. Many people think that the word Stoicism is just for the leaders of ancient civilizations that you only read about in history books. The term was made famous by great philosophers like Marcus Aurelius and Epictetus. However, you may be astonished to find that there are many more people who practice Stoicism today than you might have guessed. In today's video, we are going to introduce you to five modern-day Stoics who might surprise you. These people are celebrities, athletes, and content creators that you probably are already a fan of, but you may never have realized that their beliefs align with the ancient Stoic philosophy. But first off, let's first define Stoicism. In its simplest form, the practice of being Stoic involves having little to no outward emotion towards the things that happen in life. This means that anything that causes great joy, sadness, or anger will all elicit the same calm collected response from someone who practices Stoicism. The reason why Stoics don't react strongly to any of the things that happen in their lives is that they believe that nothing is all that important and that everyone is on an equal playing field. They believe that good and bad things happen, but that they are not worth either celebrating or worrying about. Now that you know what Stoicism is, Let's talk about who you might know that practices Stoicism. Again, the names on this list may startle you. You are most likely familiar with their work already. So, who are five modern-day Stoics? Ryan Holiday? Yes, Ryan Holiday. Despite his young age, he is considered the father of the modern-day Stoicism movement. He was first introduced to Stoicism when he was a student and found a deep connection to the philosophy of Stoicism through the works of Marcus Aurelius. Studying Stoicism opened up an entirely new world for Holiday, and it quickly became a passion for him to live a Stoic life. He has written multiple books on the art of Stoicism including his bestseller, The Daily Stoic. He also has a podcast, dailystoic.com slash podcast, and a robust website, dailydad.com that is dedicated to all things Stoic. Tom Brady Tom Brady is widely loved and even hated by football fans for his success and skill as one of the best football quarterbacks in NFL history. One of his best qualities is that he seems to be able to stay calm during even the most stressful plays during the game. He maintains a straight face and is able to perform at a high level even when the execution of critical game-winning plays relies on him. He credits much of his attitude and ability to remain centered during these trying moments to Stoicism. He has been known to quote Marcus Aurelius in interviews and social media posts, further proof that he is a student of Stoicism. Tim Ferriss Tim Ferriss is a well-known entrepreneur, podcaster, and best-selling author best known for the 4-Hour Workweek. He has gained tremendous success in recent years, and he has Stoicism to thank for much of it. Ferris makes it a point to talk about Stoicism any chance he gets. He has been open about its influence on his life since 2009, well before Stoicism was as trendy as it is now. He is one of the main voices in the modern-day Stoicism movement because he believes so strongly in the philosophy as a lifestyle. He talks about it regularly during speaking engagements on his blog and podcast, The Tim Ferriss Show. Often ranked number one business podcast on Apple Podcasts, it was the first business slash interview podcast to surpass 100 million downloads. Anna Kendrick Although it might seem like most of the modern day Stoics are men, even female celebrities like Anna Kendrick are influenced by this ancient philosophy as well. This might help you realize that many people practice Stoicism even if it doesn't seem like it. The beauty of Stoicism is that it's a practice, so you can work towards it without having to execute it perfectly every day. There is a spectrum of Stoicism, and it will look different for everyone. 
Anna Kendricks has mentioned in several interviews that she has been actively working on practicing Stoicism in her life. She keeps a copy of Meditations by Marcus Aurelius on her bookshelf so that she can reference it when she is having a difficult time remaining Stoic. Admittedly, Kendrick says that she struggles with Stoicism at times because her natural state is one of more stress and high emotion. Her openness in discussing that Stoicism is a work in progress rather than a practice that has to be perfect is inspiring to many aspiring Stoics. Robert Greene Robert Greene is a best-selling author who has written six books, his latest being The Daily Laws, which was published in 2021. He also co-wrote a seventh book with the rapper 50 Cent, The 50th Law. He writes about human behavior including power dynamics, strategy, and even seduction. His books are deeply rooted in psychology and in understanding why humans act the way they do. To date, he sold millions of copies worldwide and his work is revered by many. Much of his work draws on Stoic philosophies as he weaves the concepts into his work in many different ways. Robert Greene has been a student of the Stoic philosophy for over three decades, so he is something of a master on the topic. His interest in Stoicism started when he began to research for his books and he discovered the work of Seneca and Aurelius. In conclusion, Stoicism is an ancient philosophy that has been practiced by many throughout history. Although it might seem like most of the modern-day Stoics are men, even female celebrities like Anna Kendrick are influenced by this ancient philosophy as well. The beauty of Stoicism is that it's a practice, so you can work towards it without having to execute it perfectly every day. That's it for today's video. Thank you for watching.